Willis, and thank you, Governor Inslee. Ladies and gentlemen, individual mobility is one of the main future questions, and BMW has a really inspiring solution. Please welcome Dr. Norbert Reitova, CEO of BMW Group. Ladies and gentlemen, innovation drives change, and truly revolutionary innovations can even transform society. There is a powerful idea behind them and a strong desire to create something better for tomorrow. This is why we are here today. We are at the starting blocks, Governor, as you mentioned it, at the starting blocks of a new era, the era of sustainable mobility. Welcome to New York City, one of America's largest cities with over 8.3 million residents. I'm delighted to present, for the first time, the BMW i3, and I would like to say, big changes start small. Looking back in history, we can find many examples of this. Today, the BMW i3 marks the beginning of a new mobility age. To put this into perspective, take a look at the mobile phone in your pocket. It's a very good example, by the way. We had more than 100 years of landline telephones, then came the mobile phone, and it completely changed how we interact with the world. The mobile phone opened up business opportunities that no one would have believed possible. Ladies and gentlemen, the car industry had waited well over a century for its own revolution. Today, the wait is over. What the mobile phone did for communication, electric mobility will do for individual mobility. The BMW i3 is more than an evolutionary step. It is a great leap forward. From sketch to street, the i3 is unique in every aspect. With the intention of creating a truly sustainable car, we conducted research in mega cities around the world. From the start, we redesigned our entire development and production processes. The BMW i3 is purpose-built around an electric powertrain to serve the needs of our megacity customers. The BMW i3 is born electric. This is premium, ladies and gentlemen, at its very best. With every step of the way from development to production to after sales, the BMW i3 sets new benchmarks in sustainable mobility. In the brand new architecture, we use carbon fiber from Washington State, a first in high volume car production. Our expertise in manufacturing with this material makes the passenger cell extremely strong and lightweight. We produce the carbon fiber using hydroelectric power and we build the BMW i3 using wind power. This is an industry first. Our innovative production methods are also unique. Carbon fiber components are bonded together in a fully automated process. The innovations of the BMW i3 go beyond R&D and production to include customer experience. We will support all of our BMW i3 customers with a comprehensive set of premium service offerings. This approach, 360 degree electric, will make BMW i3 driving enjoyable and easy. And of course, the BMW i3 will share one dynamic quality with every other BMW on the road. It will be an ultimate driving machine, of course. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, in response to global trends such as urbanization and increasing carbon emissions, sustainability is an important part of a modern urban lifestyle. The BMW i3 is a perfect solution to the mobility needs of people here in New York. Mayor Michael Bloomberg has committed to making New York City is the greenest city on earth. 
We also applaud Mayor Bloomberg's efforts to connect public parking spots in New York City for electric vehicle charging up to 20% over the next seven years. This promotes not only sustainable mobility solutions, but also very important cost savings. Charging your electric car costs up to 30% less than the average of what you now pay at the pump. Ladies and gentlemen, the car has existed for nearly 130 years. Today marks a shift, a change in the future of mobility. The BMW Group is proud to be driving this change. Today, the BMW i3 begins a new era, the era of true sustainable mobility. Thank you very much. Thank you, Norbert. And now please welcome Peter Schwarzenbauer, member of the BMW Board of Management. Are you excited about this, Peter? Oh, I'm totally excited, absolutely. Ladies and gentlemen, the BMW i3 is a global project, a global solution for a global challenge. And this is the reason why there is not only one event here in New York City, but also in other cities around the world. Yes, you're right, Peter. There are also events in one of the most fascinating cities in Europe, London, and one of the most important cities in Asia, Beijing. And in a couple of minutes, we'll be connected live via satellite with these cities. This is history in the making. With global warming and everything in America about CO2 emissions and cap and trade, you guys are making history today. Yeah, I think it feels like history is being made. And uh, I am looking forward to seeing the reaction from the audience when the car is reviewed. Before today, we brought our concept to car shows and hosted test drives. But now, we will share the serious car with the world. Never before has the BMW Group been so proud to present a car to the world. Well, you guys had to do a lot of research. Many years of research? Yeah, definitely. I mean, we did research around the world in all the big cities, and some of them we are seeing today. Well, well, you're making change right here in New York City and all over the world. So hopefully soon we'll begin our countdown in London and Beijing and New York City. Here we go. talking from New York City. And with me here today is Dr. Norbert Reindhofer, CEO of the BMW Group, and Peter Schwarzenbauer, member of the management group. Norbert, what message do you have today uh, from BMW Group to the world? I mean, we, together, we are entering a new era. This is more than the birth of a unique car. It's a milestone in the automotive industry. With the BMW i3, we are showing what tomorrow's individual mobility looks like today. How we define premium, how unique design sets standards and continues to fascinate customers. The i3 is more than just a car, it's a revolutionary step forward into sustainable mobility. This is a day future generations will remember. Thank you, Norbert. BMW is a holistic project and much, much more than only a car. As Norbert said, we talk about the basic topics, next premium, visionary mobility, and inspiring design. 
to learn more about this first topic, we're connected with the city and experts on the topic of Next Premium. Good morning, New York, and good evening, Beijing. This is London. We've enjoyed an exciting discussion about the future of the premium concept, one of the main topics of the BMWi project. Here in London, we have two members of the board joining me on stage: Dr. Ian Robertson and Dr. Herbert Deese. Dr. Robertson, what exactly does Next Premium stand for? You know, for us, premium means being at the forefront of innovation, and of course, taking responsibility for future generations. And we can see our customers' values are really changing. They still want sheer driving pleasure, but with a clear conscience. And that's why Next Premium is strongly defined by sustainability. Now, from the beginning, we set sustainability targets for BMW i in every division around the company. We pursued these goals with the same passion we pursue our targets for quality or for cost. And this sets us apart from our competitors. This is what makes BMW the ultimate driving machine. And Dr. Dees, what is it that sets BMW i3 apart from any other electric vehicle on the roads today? The BMW i3 was really purpose-built as an electric car. We took a holistic approach in developing the BMW i3. I believe we have completely redesigned mobility with new drive technologies. A revolutionary concept and new materials. The use of carbon fiber is a key technology in offsetting the usual weight disadvantage of an electric vehicle. Carbon fiber is about 50% lighter than steel, very durable, and offers many possibilities for design. This makes it safe and allows for compact exterior dimensions combined with a generous interior space. I'm confident that the BMW i3 will rewrite the rulebook of our industry. Thank you very much, Dr. Dees and Dr. Robertson. Innovative ideas, sustainability, and attractive offers—that's part of the vision at BMW. But there are also global needs, which lead us to our next topic: visionary mobility. Hello, London. Good morning, America. This is Beijing calling. We had a great dinner and wonderful talks about future mobility, one of the three main topics from the project BMW i. Dr. Martin Alt from Munich gave us a great lecture. Now, please let me introduce to you Dr. Friedrich Eichner, member of the board of management of BMW AG Finance, and Mr. Harro Kruger, member of the board of management BMW AG Production. Now, first of all, Dr. Eichner. Does the BMW i3 represent the company's vision of tomorrow's mobility? Absolutely. The BMW i3 is a symbol of innovation, strength, and pioneering spirit. It stands for taking the long view and acting with foresight. As for BMW i, meeting people's current mobility needs is not enough. We want to exceed our customers' expectation and anticipate their future needs. One thing is for sure. Tomorrow's mobility must be both sustainable and strongly interconnected. Our innovative mobility services will improve people's lives, especially in large cities. The response so far has been extremely positive. More and more customers are using our Drive Now car sharing service and our innovative apps, such as Park Now, Park at My House, and My City Way. This proves we are moving in the right direction. I'm truly convinced we have a game changer here. 
where sheer driving pleasure meets intelligent connectivity to offer visionary mobility. And of course, we planned from the beginning that this venture will be profitable. And Mr. Kruger, speaking from the production side, just what was the challenge in producing this new vehicle? How difficult is it? Quite simply, visionary mobility can only happen with visionary processes. With the BMW i3, we are reinventing automotive production and engineering. It has a unique architecture, a passenger cell of carbon fiber and an aluminum chassis. This is the first time carbon fiber is used in large-scale production in our industry. It's a technological breakthrough and a competitive advantage for us. We are setting new production standards when it comes to time, costs, and use of resources. And the associates at our Leipzig plants are thrilled to be part of this exciting endeavor. Thank you, Mr. Kruger, and you, Dr. Eichner. Carbon dioxide free individual mobility, sustainable production, and intelligent services. That's the vision of BMW. Needless to say that the BMW i3 is a big leap forward in terms of technology, in terms of hardware and software. It also sets a new standard for design. Thank you very much, Beijing. Thank you, London. Next, premium and visionary mobility are two of the three topics we have to talk about. And Jade, you're absolutely right. The third topic is also very important, inspiring design. Peter, how important do you think design will be for the success of BMW i3? We knew that uh, not only the substance, but the look and the feel of the car had to stand out. It had to be exciting, futuristic, and innovative. A BMW i3 is a true four-seater. Its design is a promise that the car's performance will fulfill. And I have to say, this is a really fun car. Mm -hmm. I think one of the things people should take away today is we are offering our customers a new dimension of sheer driving pleasure. That's exactly what the BMW i3 stands for. It's the face of future mobility. Thank you. We talk about the future, which begins today. BMW i is a project for a better and more sustainable future. And at this moment, at this right moment, to introduce the stars of tomorrow, they represent a gen generation from whom BMW created this project. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome Catalina, Zachary in London, and Sophia in Beijing. Welcome to all of you. Hello, Catalina. Hello. How are you? I'm great. And I see that you brought me something here. Wow. Well, ladies and gentlemen, this is the launch control to start in a new era. And now, Catalina, Zachary in London, and Sophia in Beijing, get prepared, but don't press the button yet. We'll all do it together. Are you ready? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah? I'll count down from three to zero, and at zero, please all press the button at the same time. Ready? Three, two, one, zero! Thanks to Catalina, Zachary, Sophia. Fantastic, you did a great job. You revealed the car right here in New York City and in London and in Beijing. 
Norbert, you and your company made a decision at a time when everyone said you were crazy. But you and BMW never gave up. After a couple of years of hard work, how does it feel to see the result? I mean, I have to say we are very proud. This is the result of great teamwork. We all share the same vision, and we turned this vision into reality. This is what BMW is known for. This is part of who we are. Our passion for mobility makes us the world's leading premium car company. Thank you very much, and thank you very much to London. I've heard you guys are going to have a big party tonight. Enjoy it and have fun. Beijing, you're still in a party. Thank you and good night and enjoy the birthday party of BMW i3. Goodbye to London. Goodbye to Beijing. Would you like to drive the car? Sure. It looks awesome. Well, maybe Norbert should help you drive. What about that?